Hi, this is Larissa Nilsson. I'm a team leader with Usborne Books and more, and I'm here on my reading rug today to show you some of the products I love to recommend for working on addition and subtraction math facts. My son has been working hard this year in first grade to learn his math facts, and I'm a little nervous about our summer break from school. I want him to keep practicing. So I am just delighted that I can put these products in his hands and help him have some extra support with practicing math facts this summer. So let's take a look at these. The first one I want to show you is our learning wrap-ups. Each one of these sets, uh, you order them individually, helps with math facts. We have them for addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, and there's also one on states and capitals. But the way these work is that they're actually individual plastic, uh, kind of like cards, I'll call them. And each one has a number family that they work on. So this is the subtraction one. This is the minus one card. There's a minus two and a minus three, etc. So you want to isolate the card you're working on. So I took the minus one one and separated it from the rest of the group. You start on this side with the numbers on this side. Uh, side of the card. So you start with seven and you put your string in the little notch right there. Then you ask yourself, what is seven minus one? Well, the answer is six. So I find six on the other side. It happens to be straight across. And then I loop back around for the next one. It's a four. Four minus one. Oh, well, that would be three. So I find the three and put the string on that notch. And I keep going all the way down. So, just like this. Okay? Now, when you get finished, and we'll just say that I did them all, you can notch your string at the bottom, and then when you flip it over, there's actually a track on the back that shows you where the right answers should have been. So you can see up there at the top where I was paying attention, I got them right towards the bottom, there's several places where I didn't because I didn't finish the problem. Okay, So like I said, we have those for addition and subtraction. The green one is addition. Uh, great tools for practicing those math facts and for building fine motor skills with moving those strings around. I also wanted to take the time today to show you our adding and subtracting activity book. This is a dynamite, colorful book that gives a lot of chances to practice the math facts. It is super colorful and has different puzzles and questions on each page. Starts out with some simple counting and then gets right into number lines and some problems with number lines and jumping around the number line. And then it gets into fact families, smaller numbers, larger numbers. It works on number bonds. And there's lots of practices and quizzes for the child to complete. There is an answer key in the back. Lots of colorful, different kinds of puzzles. And also in the back, let me get back there to show you, there are some stickers. And there are different places in the book where the activities require stickers, which always get the kids more excited to participate. This book is over 57 pages long with math activities, and it is just full of all sorts of practice for adding and subtracting. So if you are looking to practice your math facts or to get more solid on them, I can't recommend these two products highly enough learning wrap-ups, addition and subtraction, or the adding and subtracting activity book. Thanks so much.